I'm in a little subsection of Sage Ranch that's just, I guess, a little bit east of the main parking lot. And it's a beautiful, sunshiny day. I'm really happy to be alive. I saw some ravens hopping around and soaring through the air just as I came up this way. It'd be nice to be like that, wouldn't it? Once in a while. What a bunch of days lately. <laughs> Talk about commotional energy. <laughs> Talk about clearing work. It's just uh, indescribable. And uh, just writing to, to say to everybody, take heart. That's the best is yet to come. Uh, this work is kind of rocky and kind of bumpy. And it may seem like you're on a slippery slope sometime, but there's a sure course being plotted for for each one of us individually. And it's up to us to to look up instead of looking down. Look up uh, for the for the help that's there. You can look two feet above your head. You can think of your spiritual guide. You can think of the angels, the ascended masters right there around you, taking care of you and guiding your every step. But you have to ask. You have to ask your higher self or one of these higher aspects of our being for guidance. Because it's, it's tough right now. And I had one other thing to say, and that has to do with staying grounded while we're, while we're seeking spiritual advice from those um, far above us. I think it's important to feel our feet and to feel all around us the energy, the energy of Earth, and to feel above us the guidance of all these, these wonderful beings and spirits. But all at the same time, huh? What you might call try locating. Locate above your head and including your crown chakra. Locate your heart and locate your feet all at the same time. And that way we'll, we'll remain like lightning rods for the incoming energy. We'll, we'll remain true to ourselves. We can feel our pranic column energy and we can feel our physical bodies too. And we'll never get swept off our feet by the new energies. Or too engrossed in the clearing to the point where we're, we're concerned about the things that are coming up instead of allowing ourselves to, to transform them and clear them from Earth. So three things, right up above the head, all the guidance you'll ever need. In the heart, the place where we transform everything, and in the feet that connect us to Mother Earth. Y'all take care. Love you lots. Talk to you later. <laughs>